what's going on guys? My name is Mojo Kicks and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at the new Clot Nike Sakai LD Waffle and everything you need to know about the sneakers release as well as my resale predictions for this shoe. But without further ado, let's get right into today's video. you know Clot did release an Air Max 1 and not just one colorway but three different colorways earlier this year. Obviously this Nike Sakai LD Waffle is in the classic colors of the Clot brand. The shoe will be releasing on September 14th. It's going to be set at a retail price of 170 USD. Now the sneaker will be releasing on the Nike sneakers app as well as some other boutiques maybe like Kith and Concepts will be getting the shoe. I would also check on some of the raffle apps and check some of the stores that do have raffles as some of them could be open right now. I I don't think there's going to be a crazy amount of raffles for the shoe. It is a collab with Clot, so I do think it's going to be fairly exclusive to Nike sneakers. Now this Nike Sakai LD Waffle Clot comes dressed in a net orange blaze, deep red and green bean color scheme that obviously nods to the kiss of death. Air Max 1 that dropped earlier this year. This LD Waffle is a bit different from, you know, the Fragment Sakai LD Waffle we recently saw, as it does feature a translucent upper. Other than a suede and mesh upper, I do think that the Fragment Sakais look a bit bulkier. They are the same model, but in a way they look almost completely different, as the Claw one looks a lot more, you know, narrow and the fragment one looks a lot more bulky and it has a little bit more structure to it now this pair will obviously be coming with dual tongues and dual swooshes as well as with co-branding found on the tongues heels and insoles now the official sakai store did have a raffle for the shoe and that was back on september 9th the raffle is closed now and i believe the winners have been notified the juice store also did have a raffle for the shoe as well and that was from september 6th to september 7th now that was via the juice store app and the raffles were a bit different for each country as international and Hong Kong were able to enter via the app. Juice Shanghai was via the web and US residents were able to enter via juicestoreusa.com. Now, according to Nike and Clot, there will be another colorway of this Sakai Clot LD Waffle coming soon and that will be launching at a later date. That one is the same kind of upper and material. The only difference is obviously the colorway. We don't have too many pictures of this colorway, but for what we know in the pictures we do have now, it seems to sport an obsidian gray and navy makeup, which apparently was inspired by the Air Max One Clot, Kiss of Death, follow-up colorway, which released back in 2013. Now the resale on the gray one is currently absolutely crazy. It's going for almost $10,000 on StockX. That colorway could very well be, you know, an Asia exclusive, or it could release world wide like this orange blaze colorway now going back to the dual tongues and swooshes also it will be coming with dual laces as well i don't know if that originally comes on the shoe when you first get it but i do know that you will be able to put dual laces on this shoe just like any other sakai shoe now moving on to resell for the sakai clot LD Waffle. Resale honestly isn't too high and I wasn't expecting resale to be anything too high. Resale currently is around the $230 to $300 price range depending on size and it's definitely not bad but I do think you know if it was back in 2018 or 2019 the shoe would be probably double the price right now. I don't know how much demand this Clot Sakai LD Waffle will have. It obviously is a Clot and a Sakai collab. The Fragment ones that recently dropped did have a decent amount of demand but I feel like this colorway isn't for everyone and probably isn't everyone's favorite. I think resale sell after the release probably come down to maybe 215 220 probably stay around there and that's after everyone gets their pairs in i think over time the shoe could go up and eventually you know a long-term hold i could see it maybe 250 275 and hovering around there i don't think the shoe will ever hit 300 to be honest unless it's super limited when it drops obviously the stock plays a big factor in the resale value but make sure to let me know down in the comments your guys thoughts on this new nike ld waffle sakai clock collab in the orange blaze colorway and if you are going to be going for the shoe when it releases anyways guys thank you for watching today's video hopefully you guys all enjoyed if you did or any of this info was helpful make sure to smash that like button down below and also if you're new here do consider hitting that subscribe button but like always guys i'll catch you in the next video peace